Hey everybody, it's Matt Scherer, CEO of SBI, and welcome to the Revenue Growth Fast Frame of the Week. So what's the Fast Frame? It's three minutes of advice with executives just like you that are trying to grow faster than their industry and their peers. So I'm here with Clint Poole. Clint's the CMO and SVP of Marketing for Lionbridge. And Clint and I are going to talk about successfully launching new products. This is at the heart of what every head of marketing must be able to do successfully. And Clint has been wildly successful at doing this. So Clint, what are the three keys to getting this done? To me, there, there's three pillars that, yeah. I, that have driven our success and, and other marketers where we have seen to be successful, right? And so the first is to be customer-centric yeah. in your planning. Yeah. Product development planning, campaign planning, product launch planning, messaging, yeah. right? That sounds trite, but it's just happened in marketing that we haven't been putting the customer at the center. It's yeah. a fundamental, I do see the science pulling back to. Yeah. But that's it. Get the deep customer insights from product marketing or customer marketing, however the organization is structured. Whoever yeah. gets you those insights, yep. get those insights, keep the customer at the center of all of your planning and development processes, and nine times out of 10, you're gonna have accuracy yep. in your go-to-market efforts. Okay, very good. The second is to do everything with an agile approach. The day of long cycle planning and launch, uh, I think is over. I think there's so many variables that yep. are impacting what we do today, and we have tools with digital marketing that enable us to course correct on the fly. Yep. So campaign planning, messaging development, go to market with sales should be in an agile environment, weekly sprints, month long campaign cycles, yep. and lots of stand ups to find out what's happening using the digital insights and of course the human insights from the team that's, right. that's interacting in the field. Very good. And the last is for all, for any marketing effort is a tight integration with the sales organization, yep. right? I mean, marketing, B2B marketing should be the greatest enabler of sales. Uh, today. That is our I role. Love, I love right? that. Yeah. We, we drive revenue for the organization through the sales organization. Yeah. And I've been fortunate to be a part of sales organizations that understand the symbiotic relationship. And because of that, we've developed these strong, tight-knit engagements. Yeah. And it's not that you're just fueling their success and therefore the company's success, but also you're getting, as a marketer, you're getting all these insights from data and analytics and they give you the human element to augment that data and really understand it because they're talking to the customers every yeah. day. And between the two sources, you get it right nine times out of 10. And you talk about this concept of customer centricity and people that are listening or watching are saying, well, geez, you know, of course. But I think the, the double click on that, it isn't, hey, what we can build, it's actually, what can we sell? What is it the customers, what's the market problem, yeah. right? What's the job to be done, if you will? that your customers can't get done right now, that if you put something in front of them, and I think that's the, the key in knowing what you guys have done and you specifically on why you guys were so successful. So I love that around customer centricity. Around agile and speed, does that interlock between product, marketing, sales, and you talk about daily. I mean, you're not exaggerating. I mean, that needs to be the communication cadence. Absolutely, and there's no reason it can't be. Right? Yeah. If you decide that that's the environment that you want to work in and you hold everybody accountable, yep. that's how, that's how it, the teams operate. And yeah. they very quickly get into that sink and yeah. they very quickly see the benefit of it. Yep. Uh, so it's not hard to sell. Yeah. Right? Everyone's all of a sudden more, more successful and more accurate. And they're, of course, part of this engaged team, yeah. which always feels like winning. And when people feel like winning, they work harder. Very good. All right, folks. So customer centricity. Talked about agile and speed and the complete and total interlock between marketing and sales. That is your revenue growth fast frame of the week with my buddy Clint Poole. I wish you good luck as you try and make your number.